Now, turning to the economic calendar for the week ahead, both at home and abroad, the U.S. is set to release its consumer confidence index as well as its unemployment data. Now, in the country, South Korea will announce its industrial output and the nation's consumer price index this week. Our business correspondent, Seo Eun Gyeong, reports. On Tuesday, the conference board will publish the U.S. Consumer Confidence Index for March. The monthly updated figure was 91.3 in February, which is nearly 2.5 higher compared to a month before. The index reflects how optimistic Americans are about their economy and ability to find jobs. The number is compared to the benchmark year of 1985, when the index stood at exactly 100. An index higher than 100 indicates that consumers are more confident than they were in 1985. On Wednesday, the Ministry of Economy and Finance will announce the industrial output for February this year. In January, Korea's overall industrial output declined compared to the previous month for the first time in a month. The figure went down 0.6 percent, mainly due to decreased output in the mining and manufacturing sectors. Industrial output is one of the three major indicators which shows the macroeconomic status of a nation. The other two include consumer price index and employment rate. On Friday, the Ministry of Economy and Finance is set to release the consumer price index for March. Last month, the index saw the biggest rise in a year, increasing 1.1 percent compared to the same month in 2020. The rise was mainly caused by a price increase in agricultural and fishery products, which marks the sharpest rise in 10 years. On Friday, the U.S. Bureau of Labor Statistics will release the unemployment rate for March. The national rate stood at 6.2 percent in February, down 0.1 percentage point from a month before. However, the February figure was still higher than the one from the same time in the previous year, which was 3.5 percent. Seo Eun-kyung, Arirang News.